Hey guys, this is just going to be a quick haul slash review of some uh, candles I picked up at Yankee Candle yesterday. They were still having a uh, buy one get one in the store. They had a little coupon and a kiosk out in front of the store. Um, so I picked up a few uh, new ones. I'm not, I'm fairly new to Yankee Candle as far as their actual candles. I've burned their tarts and things before. Um, but in general, I've always gone for the Bath and Body Works candles. I feel like they're a little stronger. Um, but I wanted to try some. I've seen some reviews online and um, just wanted to give them a try. So, as you see in front of you, I have the new Butterfly Hurricane Glass they have, which I think is gorgeous. Um, and burning inside of it, I have Blue Summer Sky. Um, when I first got this candle, uh, when I first smelled it, I, I liked the smell, but it almost smelled like a more mature, like, women's perfume. Um... As I started burning it, which I just started burning it this morning, um, well, as you see, it's already got a really nice wax pool going, but as I started burning it this morning, it turned into more of a floral scent for me. Um, I love it. That's, that's, it's amazing. I'm definitely going to go back and get some tarts and things in it. It is amazing. If you like anything floral, you'll love it. Um, it's got... It's, it's almost like you walked into a field of flowers in the springtime kind of smell. It's it's wonderful. Um, so that one I will review more once I've burned it more. But so far it's got about a medium throw. And I'm burning it in my living area, which is connected to my kitchen. And I can't really smell it in my kitchen, but I can smell it as I walk into the living area. And it is, it's beautiful. It's a beautiful smell. Um, I also picked up the... Uh, shade that matches the hurricane glass which i love it's gorgeous um and as you see i'm i've been burning soft blanket with that um soft blanket i've been burning in my bedroom i love the smell initially when i smelled it in the store the girl told me to go for the two wick tumbler because they put off more of a scent so um and they have better throw um because she said that the single wick jar was actually not quite as strong so I got the two-week tumbler and I have to say I absolutely love it. Uh, it's got a great throw. Um, in my bedroom, I could smell it as I was walking down my hallway uh, going into my bedroom. And for a mildly scented candle like this, it, it, was, it has a great throw. I love it. Um, there's not much more I can say about that one. It's, it's, um, it's almost, it almost reminds me because I'm a huge fan of the old um, Tahitian Tierra flower. It almost reminds me of that a little bit. It's it's got like a perfumey kind of flowery smell. It goes great with the blue summer sky. I actually like smelling them burning together. Um, so I'm going to, you know, do a little bit more review as well of that one um, as it burns a little more, burns down a little more, and I'll let you guys know. Um, I also picked up Peach Cobbler, which the girl in the store also told me that Peach Cobbler she has at home and she has the large jar and says that it has a light throw so she said she recommended me to get it in the um two wick pillar as well so i did i got it in the two wick pillar i'm gonna give it a try i haven't tried it yet but just by a cold sniff it actually smells really great it smells like baking a peach cobbler um i love it so i also picked up windblown which ugh, it just smells like being at the beach. I let my husband smell this and sorry my dog is uh, going ham over here on my curtain sorry. <laughs> um, so I um, let my husband smell it and his description of this was it smells like we're at the beach and I agree it smells great. It's very strong in the jar um, but I have not burned it yet so I don't know. Um, but I've heard good things about it. I've heard people say that it's got a good throw, so we will see. Um, the next thing I got was actually recommended by the store clerk, uh, which is Pina Colada. I am kind of wishing I would have gotten this in the two wick pillar now because I burned it last night. Um, I burned it for about five hours. I had the uh, butterfly shade on it, so it burned wonderfully. Like it had a great wax pull, um, very nice but very light throw um i really didn't smell it i i have a candle from bath and body works called i believe it's called uh, i can't remember
remember. I think it's a Wahoo Colada or I, it's something similar to that. But it smells a lot like this, but it has a very strong throw. Um, it's a three wick, and I actually burned it uh, for the first time a couple days ago, and it smelled up pretty much like my whole hallway, living room, kitchen. It was wonderful. This one, I, I could smell it as I got close to it, but I had to be fairly close to it to notice it. Um, I really, I like the smell. It's a great smell. It's like a creamy coconut, pineapple. It, it's a great smell. Um, and I'm going to burn it more and I'll do another uh, review once I burn it more and get more of an impression of it. Um, so there's that. And then the last one that I picked up was the red raspberry, which is very popular. Um, I smelled in the store. I didn't really care for the cold smell. Um, it, it almost smells plasticky at first, but the girl there assured me that it is amazing once it starts burning. She said it's got a very strong throw. Um, and it, it really smells like fresh raspberries. I could smell the raspberry, um, obviously. It, it smelled, it had a strong smell. Um, smell the raspberry, and it smelled like very tart, very um, obviously fruity. But I mean, it had a, a good smell. It just had kind of a weird, um, I don't like artificialness to it when I sniffed it. But she said it doesn't. She said it smells like that when you sniff it, but when you burn it, it actually smells way better. So we'll see. I'm going to try it out. Um, I'm actually thinking about going back today and getting more, uh, some tarts in the blue summer sky because I mean, I love it, love it, love it, love it. And I've never been a huge floral person. Um, even though I do like the Tahitian tear flower and that sort of thing, I've never been a big floral person. But this candle is amazing, and I really like the color and the way it looks in the jar. I think it matches. It looks great. Um, the actual scent description on this is from uh, Yankee Candle is, Let the sun shine in. Nothing seems as perfect as a big, bright, and beautiful blue sky on a summer afternoon. The air always seems cleaner. The earth moves. The earth more fragrant. This bright fragrance captures all the glory of a heavenly summer day with the crisp clean scent of summer berries and fresh ginger, enhanced with notes of jasmine, orange blossom, and blue lotus. I have to say the jasmine is more prominent to me. I don't really smell the ginger or the um, berries as much. I, I feel like the jasmine is the more prominent in the scent, um, but I mean, it's, it's amazing. I love it. I love it. Have definitely recommend this candle. But in the two wick, tumbler not in the uh, jar just because the two tumblers got a better throw and it is a fairly lightly scented candle um but like i said i can smell it does smell my living area up it doesn't necessarily travel into the hallway or the kitchen um like the soft blanket did but it smells amazing so that's it um thank you for watching uh leave comments below on what you like or have liked from the new Summer Spring Collection from Yankee Candle. And I'll see you soon.